Hey guys, today I'm gonna to make the Thai style salmon and it's gonna be somewhat spicy, but it's gonna have that uh, traditional sort of Asian flavor to it. So the main thing is the marinade. And with something like salmon, you only need to marinate for about 30 minutes, some people one hour. Unlike meat, which you might marinate for hours and sometimes even a few days, salmon's really good. So let's get started. What's my key ingredients? A little bit of fish sauce, sesame oil, salt and black pepper, a little bit of crushed garlic. And I like the tried and tested, uh, tested sweet chili sauce. So it's very, very simple. So just follow. It's really, uh, it's not about the perfect blend. It's your choice. It's a little bit of uh, the sweet and sour. So the combining is the key. So what we're going to do is start off with a quarter teaspoon of garlic. Now you might do that for one, one fillet, but I have the whole fish here, two fillets. So at the very least you want maybe a teaspoon. But for me, I'm a garlic lover, so there's two teaspoons right there. And then this, ordinarily you'd do like say two tablespoons olive oil, I mean, sorry, uh, sweet chili. I can kind of guesstimate myself how much to put in there. And I like the pepper because the pepper makes it pop. Frankly, the salt, so it's, it's as much to taste. The salt is really to kind of put it together. You don't really need the saltiness. There's so much of the flavors in the fish and uh, the sauces. For example, the fish sauce here, like an anchovy sauce. You just need a few drops, that's all you need. And that's it. So we're gonna just whisk that up. And the only thing necessary now is sesame oil. Just enough to taste. If you want a little bit of um, sort of uh, oomph, then you contrast it with some rice vinegar. You've got the sweetness from the sweet chili. You've got the vinegar to, uh, to contrast with that. And again, maybe half as much on the vinegar side. And that's my guesstimation, guesstimation there. And the easiest thing you can do is after you stir that, maybe take a little taste. And ordinarily, you just put it right over the top. But what I'd like to do is just take a little bit of salt and pepper on the back of the fish. And then it'll be skin side down, so the skin's gonna get crispy when it's in the oven. And the oven's gonna be at 500, because you really wanna get that sear and that sugar become caramelized over the top. And, um, and the, just a little bit of salt and pepper on, on the bottom. If you really want to be special, then you could kind of smear a little bit of garlic across it. Again, with just love garlic, because that crispy skin is something you really want to enjoy, so you can just spread that, spread that out. You don't want it on the pan, because it's going to burn. So just spread that out. Okay, cool. Now I'm just going to turn that over. Ready to put the marinade on the top. You might want to save just a little bit towards the end. And then again, just give it a little, spread that out a little bit. Perfect. Yeah, that's it. We're ready to put that in the oven. And the oven is going to be 500 uh, degrees, so it really gets that sear. And for something like this size, 15 minutes, that's all it takes. 